my lovelies welcome back to my channel and for everybody who is new I'm Leora and I'm so glad you found me okay sweeties welcome to today's wrapping tutorial which is uh, this this is the soul wrap and I wanted to just quickly tell you as always why I'm calling it that this past week when I'm filming this I saw comments on the Rapunzel Facebook community group um, things like or it was not really comments it was more like posts you know and I can actually say that I've seen that a lot over time that people are posting Posting, this is my wrap of today but it's not as good as Leora's or whoever's okay so I just want to encourage you sweeties it is your soul it's not the wrap it is your soul that is in the wrap okay so you can do whatever you want you can wrap whatever you want and you will always sparkle because your soul is the one that fills it with life okay it's not the wrap it's not the scarves it's not the shaper it's you put yourself into it and just play and don't think and just feel it and then you will just sparkle like nothing else it's not me who is better it's not someone else who is better it's you it's you, you know, and that's why I want to call this the soul wrap because I want to tell you with this, just put your soul in it because your soul is what we are all seeing. I just want to sort of make a statement here, you know, if I were to do on purpose the worst wrap I've ever done and I would just sit here and smile and be happy about it, then you would still think it's beautiful because it's not the wrap, okay? So we're all playing here, um, you know, this is a playground for creativity and I just want to encourage you to you never need to apologize or to think I'm not as good as it's not about that at all we're all on the same level here yes some of us are more experienced and some not but it's a journey also for me I'm still on the journey and and that's what it is so that is my reasoning for the wrap I did this wrap a couple of days ago I wore it in one of my videos and this is how it looked so there of course I used my own scarves today I'm going to use Rapunzel scarves and and I'm also super excited to introduce to you the new Bobo Shaper that I've just gotten. So this is also what I'm wearing today. I'm going to take it off in a second and I'm going to show you everything and that is what we're doing today. Of course, this video is all my wrapping tutorials is in collaboration with Rapunzel who has supplied everything you're seeing here. And with that being said, I think we're ready to go into the introduction of the Bobo Shaper and of course the wrapping tutorial for the Soul Wrap. I hope you enjoy. Okay, sweeties, welcome to the tutorial part. Okay, I'm wearing right now my Wendy Shaper and I'm only doing that so I have something on my head and also because I want to show you sort of the difference between the Wendy Shaper and the Bobo, <laughs> the Bobo Shaper. So this is super, super new on Rapunzel and I am so excited that I just got this a couple of days ago and I have only worn it twice so far. I've also tried to do a half wrap with this already. I felt super ridiculous. I have to play with that a little bit but then I will definitely try to do a tutorial or two with half wraps too because like personally I have no problem with that so that is um, <laughs> anyway so that is the Bobo Shaper and honestly this is the best one I've ever seen and that has nothing to do that this is Rapunzel or not because I have another Bobo Shaper that is like for half wraps and I don't like it it has velcro and it is like I just don't like it so it doesn't matter this is such a good concept it makes so much sense to have these um, these things to to tie it basically or to like wrap it around your head it makes it so much more versatile and so much more comfortable that I just can't even believe that they came up with this this is amazing so anyway I know there has been a lot of questions because this was sold out within such a short time so there have been so many questions about when is this coming back is this coming back sweeties I have the confirmation from Rapunzel that this is going to be permanent on the Rapunzel website it is just that there is one person that is producing them and she's doing a phenomenal job because this looks amazing but there is one person who's producing this and that's why it's just smaller quantities coming in so please don't give up hope and please don't give up your patience because there are more coming and this will be something that will always be available you know once it is available so just say 
saying if I'm featuring this now and it is right now not in stock so don't give up because it's coming okay just saying okay but I didn't want to like uh, not talk about it because th that would be such a shame because I wanted to <laughs> okay so in a second I'm going to um, take this one off and I'm gonna put this one on and today I'm going to do my wrap with this one it is going to be a full wrap because um, like I said I want to just first play a little bit with the concept of half wraps but anyway you can use that whichever way you want you can do full wraps with this you can do half wraps with this so just so you know okay so let's just put it on and then we'll see how it looks Okay, sweetie, so this is how we're sliding it on. Of course, you can also put it up at like right till your hairline. I'm, as always, putting it a little bit further to the back. And when I wore this, the first thing I thought was this looks like a headdress from like King Henry VIII that time, the 1500s, something like this. I fell immediately in love with this. You know, put a tiara on top and you're done. You know, it's amazing. So anyway, this is how you just put it on and then you cross over those um, ties I guess I don't know how it's called <laughs> ties I guess and now you're I think you're supposed to really tie it um, behind the shaper like here yes that's my hair <laughs> never seen that right okay but I'm going to tie it up here I'm going to do it like that. I'm not 100% sure anymore what I saw in the launch video of the Bobo Shaper, how to do it, but I'm just gonna do it like this because I feel most comfortable like that. Okay, and then I'm just going to uh, slide it in wherever I can. So this does not actually have to be tied. You're just sliding it in somewhere, you know? You just find a place to slide it in. <laughs> All right, so this is how it looks now, like that. Okay, so of course I have to get used to this a little bit that basically here it goes down like like it's a steep uh, fall <laughs> sort of compared to the Wendy Shaper because the Wendy Shaper has like a real poof, right? So anyway, but that's what we're doing. Okay, now I'm going to start out with the Red Stellar Scarf which looks like this. I've used this so many times. It is really such a beautiful scarf. I really, really love it. It's really pretty with those sparkles on it, gold sparkles. Okay, I'm going to uh, flip it in a little bit because it is a wide scarf. By the way, it also doesn't have fringes if you're interested, you know. <laughs> and now I'm just going to place it from the top down, lining it up here somewhat to the front, maybe even flipping it in a little bit more. It's a whole new wrapping experience now, you know. It feels different. It absolutely feels different. And it also feels a little bit tighter around the head because you can actually control how tight it's going to be, you know? So that is really, really cool. Okay, so now I'm just going to uh, cross over behind my head like this. And I'm going to just flip it in and sort it out a little bit so it looks a little bit nicer. And then I'm just going to bring it up to the top and then I'm going to tie a knot in the middle like this. And I'm going to do that a little bit towards the back so I have a little bit room here left in front of the knot, okay? So for now, I'm just gonna place it like this. Now, you can do this with one scarf. I'm going to do it with two. So this is the Blue Sari scarf. This is this one. And I'm also going to take the New York Brights in Kelly Green, which looks like this. And I'm purely doing this because all of those colors appear also in my skirt, which you will, of course, the combined, the whole finished look, you will see at the end of the video. Okay, this is way too big. <laughs> Constantly keeps writing up, it's very annoying. But anyway, <laughs> all right, so that is what I'm doing. I'm lining them up next to each other. And like I said, if you want to use just one, then just use one. Okay, I'm going to put that here right in front of the knot from the Stellar Scarf, okay? And I'm going to bring it towards the back and cross over. And now I'm going to bring this here down <laughs> and bring both of those up behind this knot of the Stellar Scarf. And I'm going to tie another knot here like this okay so now I'm going to put this towards the back just so it's out of my way and now I'm going to cross this over this that comes out to this side I'm going to bring it over to this side and I'm going to tuck it away in itself 
like this and I'm going to do the same thing with this part <laughs> like this and I'm just going to tuck it in where it sort of is like behind or underneath this part that is coming up from the bottom okay something like that and now with these here I am going to just play so it is nice to have something that gives you a little bit of volume but you don't have to I'm just sort of putting it down and then I'm just sliding it behind itself you know just like that there is no real like knowledge to it <laughs> I'm just sliding it in and having this little fancy thing going on up here so that is all <laughs> That is all and I think it is really really cool. What do you think? Like <laughs> sorting myself out. I think this is really really cool. Let me just turn around. So this looks completely different, right? This is like um it's 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 different. It's different from the Wendy Shaper. Um I think overall from the look um I think I'm going to still have the Wendy Shaper as my most favorite but I think this is going to rank in second place from now on because it still gives me the volume that I want and also the height that I want I think that is really really nice um yeah I just I think I do personally prefer the rounded shape of the Wendy Shaper the, the rounded back but still I think it is a super super cool look and it's just something that one has to get used to you know it's like it's like comparing apples and oranges you know so it's both fruits but it's different <laughs> right so anyway that is it I think this is this is the finished look and I think I really really like it depending on again depending on what scarves you're using you can make this look super elegant you can make it look super playful today I think it is more playful last time when I did it which I showed you in the beginning that was more elegant as far as I'm concerned <laughs> maybe not color wise but scarves scarves wise I guess it was more elegant um, yeah so it is what it is you can play with this as always and you can of course also do it with different shapers you just have to modify a little bit you know adjust the wrap a little bit to your own needs so that is it let me know what you think leave me your comments of course in the comment section down below besides that you will find all the contacts for Rapunzel and everything that I've used as much as I can link I will link in the description box plus there's also my social media if you want to follow me there and see more looks then you can do that and of course as always if you want to order something from Rapunzel you can use my affiliate code which is Queen Leora in all caps in one word which will give you five percent of your order okay sweeties this is it for today i hope you did enjoy yourself with the new wrap and with the new bobo shaper when you're uploading pictures i am so excited to always see what you're doing which color combinations you're coming up with this is like the best thing for me and i can't wait to see you there and if not then i'll see you here either next week for my next wrapping tutorial or tomorrow for my next video on my channel before you leave please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and check out my other videos if you're new here and I up until next time, definitely go ahead and sparkle. Hugs and kisses. Bye.